We believe that courses should be structured in a way which serves student learning, not an assessment schedule. Assessment shouldn't be something that you put in a mark book and forget about until reporting time. Instead, assessments should be ongoing and formative. And provide not only a picture of where the student sits right now, but guide the next steps of what they learn. Student learning should be front and centre. Assessment should only exist to enable learning to take place. And reports are simply there to draw upon that data. I believe that students should learn maths in a variety of modes. When you're in class, you shouldn't feel rushed trying to get through all the dot points on the curriculum. Instead, class time should be balanced. There should be room for handwritten math skills to develop alongside digital technologies. There should also be room for real-world applications, group work and deep discourse. Students must graduate with creative problem-solving skills. And the ability to apply the knowledge they have gained. I believe that my relationships with the students are critically important. The time I spend on explicit instruction and preparing work should not push everything else into the background. Instead, explicit teaching should remain part of the mix. But the most impactful and enjoyable parts of teacher practice should move into the foreground. Like providing feedback. And building the student's self-confidence. I believe that students should deeply understand the maths that they are learning and enjoy that learning. Students shouldn't just rote learn a bunch of new recipes each year, forgetting last year's recipes. Instead, they have to form deep conceptual understanding. This will allow them to problem solve. Then they're able to transfer that knowledge into different subject areas. And definitely the real world. We believe that meeting the learning needs of a diverse range of students requires them to be learning different mathematics at the same time. We should not be batching students into a one-size-fits-all production line. Well, everybody is expected to meet the same age-based objectives. Instead, I believe we should be meeting the individual needs of every single student. We can only build mathematical understanding cumulatively. With new learning drawing from an existing understanding of the sub-concepts. All students. All students. All students. All students should grow along a continuum from wherever they happen to be.